Sorry for the watermark, people. What is up, YouTube? Sir Hunt's Reviews, and surprise, I have a special video for you guys today. This is going to be a video on the newest images released by HBO on Twitter. Alright, so let's get right into it. So this first image up here, we have Joffrey Lannister, <coughs> Catelyn Stark, and the relation between those two is Joffrey, in my opinion, the relation between those two is going to be Joffrey died from poison, the strangler, which ultimately made him choke to death. And same with Catelyn Stark. She was not poisoned, but she basically choked to death on her own blood. She had her throat slit. Then moving right along, we have Ned Stark and Tyrion Lannister. The obvious relation between those two is going to be that Ned Stark is a very honorable person. So is Tyrion Lannister. Maybe not quite as honorable as Ned. Definitely not quite as honorable as Ned. But the relation between those two is that Tyrion is the most noble and most honorable of his house. So, they could say that dying in a similar way, uh, I don't see Tyrion getting his head cut off, but I could totally see him dying for, like, an honorable death, sort of what Ned died for. Um, then we have, last but not least, Arya Stark and the boy Jamie Lannister. Um, I don't think there's really a relation between the two of them. When I first saw this image, the first thing that came to mind is Arya Stark is going to be stabbing Jamie Lannister in the faces of face. Next up, we have another big size poster. We have Jon fucking Snow and Danny. The obvious relationship or similarities between these two being next to each other is going to be that one's a Zora High, one's a prince that was promised. They are both super likable characters. Um, <clears throat> their journeys are very similar, meaning like they start off with nothing and make something of themselves. Obviously, Danis, Daenerys starts off being kind of nothing, slow, sold to Khal Drogo, then becomes this queen of marine. Then you have Jon Snow. He starts off as kind of like a something, but he's still a bastard. You know what I mean? Then he's sent to the wall, basically starting off at nothing, and now he's the Lord Commander. Well, he got his throat slit. But anyway, then we have Rob Stark and Catelyn Stark. Not too much, or sorry, not Catelyn Stark, fucking Sansa. Not too much a relationship, again, between there, other than the fact that they're brother and sister, and I totally see Sansa Stark um, taking Rob Stark's place in the North, meaning, like, she's gonna rule from Winterfell. Jon Snow, obviously, will probably be handling other shit. Um, then we have Cersei Lannister and Oberyn Martell. Not very much in common between those two other than the fact that Oberyn is extremely li likable and most people hate Cersei. Also, you have the fact that Marcella was being taken care of by Oberyn, who said, we don't harm little girls in Dorn, but then of course you have um, <clears throat> Jamie coming back this season with a dead Marcella. Alright, so this is just a close-up of Catelyn Stark's face. So then we have this close-up of Robert Baratheon. His quote is, I was never meant to be a father. Okay, so just let me reiterate real quick. Um, each one of these singular fic pictures came with a quote, and that's what I'm reading to you. So Melisandre's quote was, there's only one war, and that's war against life and death. So then we have this scumbag, lead of the harpy fuck, and his quote is going to be, I have two talents in this world, war and women. And I think that pretty much summarizes it and lets us know that he is going to fucking be the leader of the harpy. Alright, then we have Arya Stark, and her quote is, anyone can be killed. Um, we obviously know she's probably going to end up killing the boy Jamie this season, but I don't know. And then we have Tyrion Lannister. Um, he is, quote, is known as being saying, or his quote with his picture is, if you want justice, you've come to the wrong place. Hopefully he does some badass dwarf shit. You raped her, you killed her, you murdered her family. Uh, Oberyn Martell, and his quote is, I will be your champion. Next up, we have my wife. She is fucking amazing. I love her so much. Um, and her quote is going to be, I will do what queens do and I will rule. Um, God, look at those cheekbones, that structure, that face. I'd love to just... Moving right along. Then we have Tormund Giants Bane, and his quote is, If you lie to me, I'll put your guts through your throat. Sounds pretty fucking intimidating, as we all know he is very intimidating himself. Alright, so then we have Jamie Lannister, and his quote is, You don't get to choose those whom you love and he's a twin fucker speaking of twin fucking but nah for real um sh the rest of these pictures didn't exactly have quotes with them so i'll make them up as i go along all right so she says i like to fuck my brother i was the product of incest between those further two pictures you've just seen and i like to fuck sheep the north remembers winter is coming
I have big round balls, Sam. This is Nymeria Sand, and she's also known as a huge fucking waste of our time back in season 5. Then we have, of course, Rob Stark. He is fucking awesome, not gonna make fun of him. Then we have Sophie Turner, aka Phoenix, aka Sansa Stark. Hi. I know you guys probably didn't think you were gonna see me this video, but fucking surprise! This has been Sir Hunt's Reviews. I wanna thank you guys for watching. Sorry about my lighting, but. You guys are awesome. Shoot for, say, two or three likes this video. I'm almost at 300 subs. I just want to take a little bit of time to say, Thank you for being a friend. Travel around the road and back again. The hardest part. I'm just kidding. Um, this has been Sir Hunts. Reviews. One more thing, there is a weird little watermark that shows up um, in my video at certain points. I try to get rid of that. I'm using a new video software that I downloaded a trial for, and apparently it puts a watermark on your videos. So I had to use two different editing softwares, but sorry about that. Hopefully you guys won't unsubscribe to me for that. What does one say to the mini-face god of death? Sorry for the watermark, people.